Hello and welcome to the channel. Today I have for you a pop alert. But in case you're new here or if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. And while you're at it, click that little notification bell. That way you never miss one of my news videos and we'll roll this intro and get on into it. Today's pop alert is going to be all ECC pops. But before we get into them, I'm going to need you to go ahead and like this video because that is the best way to support the channel. And it also shows me that you are enjoying these pop alerts. But most of all, it shows YouTube that you are enjoying them. Now that we got that out of the way, let's go ahead and get on in with this pop alert. The first thing I have up for y'all today is actually an update on the tanker bug from Starship Troopers. And this pop will be a 6 inch pop. And I think this was actually a really good idea by Funko because these things were huge in the movie. So it only really makes sense for it to be an oversized pop instead of a normal size pop. Up next, here's a look at the three Dragon Ball Z pops that were announced for the ECC. First up is a green chrome piccolo, which is a shared exclusive with FYE. And I think the green chrome really works for this pop because the character is green. Sometimes they do color variants with the chrome that doesn't really fit the character. The second Dragon Ball Z pop up is the glow in the dark perfect sale. And there is no word on which retailer this will be shared with yet, but I like this pop and I can't wait to see the glow on him. The last Dragon Ball Z pop announced was the Vegeta eating noodles. And this is a shared exclusive with Amazon. Honestly, I'm on the fence with the whole eating noodles pops, but the more I look at this one, the more I'm starting to come around to it. Up next, here's a look at the Grand Budapest Hotel 2 pack. And these pops look pretty basic, but they are limited number. 1500 piece limit number, actually. And this will make all the difference in the world. Once they put that limited number sticker on it, everybody's going to want one of them. Up next is a pop I don't really know anything about. Actually, I don't know nothing about it. And that was the Dungeons and Dragons pop that was announced yesterday. But this thing is super cool. I love that it is translucent. It even has a skull in it, which I think is awesome. But other than that, I don't know anything about it. Maybe someone can help educate me with it. So leave me a comment down below and let me know more about this pop. The last thing I have up for y'all today is the two Masters of the Universe pops that was announced. And in my opinion, these are great. First up is Triclops. And I really do like this pop. But is it just me or does he remind anyone else of Plankton from Spongebob? I think it may be all the green and the one eye and the fact that he looks angry in it. But all jokes aside, I really do like this pop. The next one up is my favorite of them all, and it is He-Man, Slime Pit. I love this pop. The different colors of green are really cool. The way they made his limbs look translucent is a really nice touch to me. I can't wait to see an out-of-the-box look at this pop. And this is just a very nostalgic pop to me because I grew up on He-Man and Masters in the Universe. So that's going to do it for today's pop alert. As always, if you've heard of anything cool or interesting that I missed, leave me a comment down below and let me know what it is. And I'll give you a shout out and credit in the next video. And with all this said, I hope you all have a wonderful day and thanks for watching.